First leg of the six up, we're back onto your weather here for race number five. The fifth is a class four of 1650, headed by Jade Fortune, who's a two-time winner. Course and distance, Neil Callan from barrier number two. Chung Wah Spirits also won twice course and distance. They were both last season. Party every day, our last start course and distance uh, winner. Best for you, uh, has won two times uh, so far this season, makes his all-weather debut, as does co-partner Spirit, but still winless in the win column, Momentum Happy. Second try on the all-weather, was a winner two starts back on the turf. Hidden Spirit up in class, he's won his last three over the 1650 and last time out over the 1800 meters and lucky win-win up from the 12 to the 1650. A distance he has won at in the past. So Hidden Spirit and lucky win-win are the horses that have been up at Chung in the last month and it's certainly been working for Hidden Spirit, Mark. Ed Shaw has, he's looking for four in a row and uh, plenty of these raced against each other on the 27th of May with Megatron racing outside the leader that day, possibly in front. Momentum happy second, then lines of three from Sky Supreme back to Righteous Mate, best for you and Hidden Spirit. So again over the 1650, Paul, a few of these could be caught wide. Yeah, the first one we'll look at is Party Every Day. He, I think he's found his niece here in Hong Kong on the all-weather. He's had two starts on it for a second and a win. Uh, he really works well on it, and uh, he's come up early favourite, and I can see why. He moves nicely in his work here in, that morning. Sky Supreme, uh, he's on the improve. Um, the last couple of starts on the all-weather haven't been too bad for him. Though his problem is barrier number 14. But, uh, look, just a little bit of a quiet workout for this horse. Very fit horse. Sky Supreme, Francis Lloyd stable going well. And Zach Purton doing the work on Momentum Happy. Now, we all race, uh, ride him on race day as well. He's drawn a little bit wide in barrier 10, but he also goes forward and doesn't look, look to be too much pace in this, so he should be quite well suited. All right, we'll come back to Momentum Happy in a moment or so. Let's start off with a win of uh, Party Every Day with a few horses in behind him. Jade Fortune, Righteous Mate, Chung Wah Spirit and General Dino uh, Mark. Um, Jade Fortune, five-pound pull, way to reverse things, I suppose. He returns to the or with the Jade Fortune after a run on the turf when a sixth behind Leap of Faith. He just finds one or two to beat him or find something to go against him. As Paul said, party every day is going, oh, Righteous Mate, he was massive. He was four lengths last ball at the 1,000 metre mark. Yeah, I've got him in there, Righteous Mate, along with these top two as well. I think it was a really good uh, runs from both these two horses. But a party every day for me just keeps to be on the improve. So uh, I'm going to stick with him. OK, party every day then for Paul. Sky Supreme, uh, the next uh, one to take a check on. Now, he's winless in 13 starts um, so far. This is his run two starts back, Paul, behind Little Thunder. Yeah, OK, I think he's another horse who's found his niche here, which is on the all-weather. This was his best run uh, to date uh, with Sky Supreme. He has drawn 14. That's, that was just a query. He had a good uh, run here and he hit the line strongly enough. Just where he's going to be in the running put me off. He's had another start since, and he was three wide the trip in that race, and he steps up for the first time to the 1650, but he did win over the 1500 at Pisa. So the 1650 should be bellissimo. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at uh, Momentum Happy. Uh, this is him on the turf, of course. This is on the back of him winning the start prior. Um, finished seventh this time, uh, Mark, to uh, Superb Daddy. Yeah, yes. it was not a bad run from uh, Momentum Happy, I think. I thought it was a really good with... Uh, win prior to this, coming to the surface for the second time. The horse is in a bit of form. He's by Dubawi, so it should be a problem, mate. Yeah, the family's won up to uh, 2,000 metres also, so as Paul said, no concerns with the distance, you wouldn't think. Zach jumps aboard. He's drawn a little wide out in barrier number 10, though. All right, Hidden Spirit up in class, but he's done absolutely nothing wrong so far. Paul, <laughs> what do you reckon of his chances? Yeah, I jumped in a bit earlier there, didn't I? <laughs> uh, head and spirit, like, it was a nice uh, run. He, he's in great form, Let, let's be honest. He's won his last three. It's whether he can now come up to Class 4 and keep winning. I thought this was quite a good, nice little Class 4 race. So I was just happy um, this time, but he's doing everything right at the moment. Yeah, 13 to 1 at the moment. Can't beat winning form. Running past Curling Luxury, he's been racing super consistently, but... It is a lot harder on uh, Saturday for him this week. Neil Cannell was on board for those three wins. He rides Jade Fortune of the top weight. This favourite, Paul, has come up 1.8, but you're with him. Yeah, I am. Uh, hopefully he'll drift out a little bit. I don't think he'll start 1.8. But uh, he, I, I think he's found his niche. The all-weather looks um, uh, perfect for me, uh, for this horse, and I think he can win this race. Uh, Jade Fortune's been running really well. He should get a nice run from Barrier 2 as well. He'll get his opportuni opportunity. Momentum Happy, I think, looks good coming back to the surface and was a big run from Righteous Mate last time. But he does get back. That's a little problem because it doesn't appear on paper to be too much pace and he'll be running on late. So I went 3 one, nine, four. You're leaning towards Guy Supreme? Uh, no. Oh. No, I've left him out. Just 
don't know how the Pisa form is going to stack up at Chartin on a Saturday. 13 goes on top. That is winning together. Started 8.7 at Happy Valley last time behind Master Albert. Now, he went with that race on the back of a very strong trial at uh, Chartin on the all-weather. And on that, he started quite short over the 1,200 Happy Valley. 16.50 looks much better. Party every day to run second. Short price favourite. Jade Fortune is going consistently. And Momentum happy to round out the first four. 13, 3, 1 and 9. No room for Sky Supreme this week. All right. You have to pull something out of the bag, though, if uh, you're, you're calling on the weekend. Uh, 3, 1 and 9. Uh, 1, 3 and 9 are all included in our numbers there in race number 5.